The first part of Donald Trump's plan enable the rapid deployment of new data centres, which are essential for the functioning of artificial intelligence. To facilitate the granting of building permits, the White House wants to reduce environmental requirements, which is a request of Silicon Valley companies such as Google. Once built, these data centres will have huge energy needs. And data centres are a growing portion of the electricity use in the US. Its power generation always has environmental impacts, but most of our existing power plants um, um, are still producing electricity via fossil fuels. Um, and most often that's natural gas if we need a new power source um, quickly. This reality has been exacerbated by Donald Trump, who already wants to increase oil and gas production, which is abundant in the United States. Beyond hydrocarbons, these data centres will consume another critical resource, water. As these GPUs generate answers and draw power in doing so, they also generate heat, which means they need, we need water to, to cool those processes down to keep the, the machine room temperatures at, at a nice stable temperature. Another consequence of this massive use of water and electricity is that American citizens could see their bills increase. Faced with these potential risks, around 100 organisations, unions, associations and environmental justice advocates have signed a text calling for a popular action plan for AI, which demands safeguards be put in place against the possible abuses of this technology.